You there? I would have a word with you. I am called Lord Jaredon Firecrack. And I bid you stand a moment and hear what I offer. Word has come to me of your actions. I see you as capable and headstrong, with the ability to handle whatever is thrown at you. Just the type of creature that I am looking for. Give me some direction, yeah. I'll see to it. You must gather your party before venturing forth. It's done. Yes? If it must be done, it's probably best left to me. How can I help? I'll help I however I can. Is it now? I think. I'm waiting. Hey, not a concern. I hope this is worth it. Be merry, friend. Glory of all. Declare yourself. You Declare must yourself. Gather your party before venturing forth. Yeah, I'll see to it. Well, <laughs> the prodigal son returns, heir to his mother's foolishness as always. Well, let me ask you, how far have you roamed, son, running away from me? 
Speak not of my mother, drunkard. You were never worthy of being her husband. I am well worried by what has gone on in this place. Though the choice seems clear and right, I am hesitant to take it. What is it? Nay, father. It is time for this foolishness to end. Shut your mouth! If you leave now, you are forever banished from this place! You will be cast from this family and become a nameless dog, not fit to cower at my feet! I have been cowering at your feet for all my life. Goodbye, father. Perhaps I shall see you again before you drink yourself to death. Gather your party before venturing forth. For the glory of Arm! I shall... Very well. You are more than welcome, my son. Gather your party before venturing forth. For the glory of all. I'm there. Who are you?
Are you interested in purchasing a bit of merchandise, my friend? I trust all is well. I trust all is well. a truly evil man. Uncle Scratchy seems like a saint in comparison. Regardless, it seems that I'm once again out of the black market. I pray it shall be gone. Shaw. My deliverance is in your hands. Wait! I recognize you! Look ye all upon this foul drow that we have found before ye. A creature of evil and darkness, my brethren. A creature of foulness and deceit, bent only on our destruction. This creature has foolishly come amongst us my brethren, thinking that we would be lax in our senses. Tell me what should be done with it. Burn it! Burn her! Burn the drow! I burn the elf! Her dark and fiendish kin rose up from their underground homes and killed my father and brother! They are all evil, I tell you, all of them! Then the drow shall burn! Gather round, my brethren, and witness the will of Bashava triumph over foul evil. You Riven are mad. I have done nothing to any of you. I seek only to make my way without molestation. Why have you done this? Why? Done nothing. You are a drow elf, are you not? That has as good a reason as any. Ye shall be silent, evil one. The power of the maid of misrule will be demonstrated here today. Burn her now! Burn her! No! Now! All our splendia! Spout your evil speech if ye must, drow, but prepare yourself for your journey into the next world. Beg for forgiveness, beg for salvation, and hope that the cleansing fire will save ye. Now, come on, kill something now! Yeah. Praise the goddess. My thanks for your timely intervention. What are you doing? Why have ye interfered with the judgment of Beshaba? Allies of the foul. This can never be allowed. <coughs> Run for it. Inserter, culture, imperial. You shall suffer my wrath. I won't let your friends be hurt. Give me some directive. It must be. I'm waiting. Yes. Feel the backhand of justice! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Give me some direction. I'm stuck in pain. You have saved me once again. I did nothing to provoke their attack, I tell you. I was passing through the city when the man guessed my identity under my hood.
My wings have been clipped. Oh, I wish you could understand how it feels to be bound to the ground, chained and weighted like a miserable prisoner of Earth. It's probably best left to me. I don't like cities much. They're built on the backs of the unfortunate. I'm waiting. For the glory of all. You have righteousness shall prevail. Point the sword, and what I can I shall do? Strike Back in line to take a fast pause. Am I? I will. <laughs> lot more exciting than any circus. Please, let me help. I hear you well enough. You point, I punch. I stand amongst the righteous. Let's do this. pool of base corruption if ever there was one. If I have not for the order, the gods would surely smite man for such sins. Give me some direction. I'm there. I'm willing. Listen to me, my brothers and sisters. Heed my words. We have been chosen as the recipients of a most holy miracle. One that should neither be dismissed nor ignored. I, Gaul, I who have been stripped of my eyes most mercifully, have been shown the truth that has eluded the sighted. The gods that you worship are false gods, icons that serve to increase the wealth of churches and heathens. Listen to them not, hold. 
You speak of blasphemy. The Morning Lord Lathander has always shown his benevolence and power. His presence among us is unquestionable. Is it, priest? I ask all of you to question for a moment if what the priest says is true. Yes, his false god grants him power to fuel his spells, much as any wizard might possess. I say that the churches lie to you. They claim their gods are present when they do nothing other than require your coin to fill their pockets. No, what you're saying cannot be true. The gods have ever protected us. Hmm, is that so? Have they protected you from famine? Have they protected you from disease? Have they wrought harmony upon Faerun? No, they have not! They lie and cloud your sight to gain your worship of their false images. I have stripped myself of their foul eyes, and I see what is the truth. The truth, I tell you! You lie, you lie! The gods exist! Such words are a horrid affront to the gods! Surely you will pay for this! Quiet! Listen to what he has to say! I call on you to abandon your false gods. They have done nothing for you. Cast them aside and join me on the true path. Join me in the calling of the true sight. That mean? Shall we tear our own eyes out then? Don't be foolish. What shall we do then? Who shall we turn to if there's no gods? But there is a god. There is the true god. The unseeing eye is here amongst us. He offers the faithful a... Do not listen to him! <sighs> what has your god ever done for me, eh? Hey? Hey? I'm poorer and no better off than I ever was. Don't speak to the priest in that tone. The gods will be offended. Don't you hear what he's saying? There are no gods to be offended. I say we see what this unseeing eye has to offer. I, I wish to see. No, my friends, you do not wish to see. Forget what the years of lies have taught your eyes. You wish to know. You wish to learn. These are the truths that the unseeing eye can offer to you. A truer gift that you'll not find amongst any of these other so-called deities. Come, witness the miracle of the truth. Come and behold the unseeing eye for yourself, and see the true God that is present amongst us. No, do not go with him. I'll do as I wish. I want the truth. Show me the unseeing eye. Yes, show me. Come then. Those of you who wish to become the truly faithful, who witness the magnificence of the unseeing eye and the truth he brings, come with me. What are you doing? Are you mad? Quit your mouth, wench. I, who do not wish to see the truth, that is your business. Come then, my faithful. Follow me. This must not come to pass. The ever-seeing eye of Helm must be made aware of what they intend. be done. Never betray trust. Such is the will of the Vigilant One.
it's probably best left to me. Your order. Give me some direction. Yeah, I'll see to it. I'm ready for anything. What can I do? Go for the eyes, fool. Go for the, the eyes, yeah! Waiting, hey, not a concern. 
sir. Give me my hope this is worth it. Hold still, I'm waiting. Yeah, yeah. I'll see to it. You must gather your party before venturing forth. be done.